it's been a while. Oh my gosh, it's too bright. I can't get to take the sunglasses off. I'm in the parking lot. I'm waiting for my husband. He's um, inside doing getting some business taken care of. And um, so it's been a while since I've done a vlog. Um, I did have my surgery. It was on July 18th. Today is August the 30th, 2019. Um, see, I wrote these stats down so I couldn't remember to tell you guys. So, so far I've lost 35 pounds. Um, I saw my surgeon on, today is Friday. I saw my surgeon on Wednesday, doing great. He's very pleased with um, how I'm doing. Um, I've, I, I should do more video, another couple more videos talking about my surgery, but um, the surgery went great. I had no complications. I had a little bit of pain coming out of um, surgery, but it really was not that bad. I think I only took maybe three or four pain pills max within like 48 hours of surgery. Um, after that, I haven't had any pain at all. Uh, my scars have healed up great. Uh, what else? Um, they had so out of surgery, they had me walking pretty much within as soon as I got to my um, hospital bed. Um, I only stayed one night in the hospital. I was out by four o'clock the next day. And let's see what else can I tell you? I do notice my weight loss is like I'm getting some. It's not so chubby in here. I'm start. I'm starting to lose this part. Um, uh, my rings are looser, wigglier. Um, there's days where I don't wear my my. These are the only two rings I wear. Um, I don't wear them because they're so loose that they kind of bother me. Uh, what else? I uh, got myself a eye watch so I could track my walking. Um, okay, yeah, let's get into the stats. So my highest weight was 345. Um, my surgery weight was like 337. I'm, I'm kind of rounding up and rounding down. My current weight is 292. Super excited to be under 300 pounds. Um, and what else can I tell you that's happening? Um, I feel great. Oh, so my goal, my daily goals, every single day, my daily goal is to drink 64 ounces of water. Some days I get it. Some days I'm eh, a few ounces short, maybe four or five ounces short. Um, usually it's because I'm too tired <laughs> and then I just want to go to sleep and I can't drink anymore. Um, my, uh, protein goal every day is 80 grams. Sometimes I hit 78, 76. I'm, I'm okay with that. Um, let's see. I haven't been chicken. I still, I can eat some chicken. Depends on the chicken. Um, deli meat I can eat now. I'm on solid foods. I have been on solid foods since week four. Um, my doctor he fast tracks you on the liquid diet. So uh, first day was just ice chips. The day of surgery, all I could have was ice chips and there was a spongy thing for my mouth. Biotin mouth spray was a godsend. Um, what else? Chapstick, my Burt's Bees chapstick, which I wish I had with me right now because my lips are dry. Um, my Burt's Bees chapstick was another godsend. <laughs> Those are the two things you, you only need entertainment electronic entertainment and those two things um as far as i'm concerned um the next day the nurse she helped me brush my teeth so that was fine um, i didn't let's see what else can i tell you um, i'm trying to think of what else you might want to know if you have any questions you can ask me questions um like I said, I got home at four o'clock. The ride home was a little difficult. I'm glad, I'm really glad I brought my own pillow. So I had my pillow um, in the hospital room and on the ride home. Uh, what else can I tell you? I didn't bring pajamas. I just wore two hospital gowns. I wore one the regular way and then I wore one backwards as a bathrobe. So that, so when I was doing my walking, I never felt exposed at all. Um, they gave, at the hospital that I go, 
that I went to was TMC, Tucson Medical Center. Um, they give you socks that have like a rubber bottom on them. You have to wear them. It's required. So I didn't, I mean, I'm a barefoot person, so I didn't wear anything um, like slippers or anything because those socks were kind of warm. Um, they put ice packs on my stomach. They also gave me a um, binder, which is kind of like, a, it looks like an ace bandage, but it's for your whole abdomen. So it went like from here down, like below where underwear go, like down. So kind of this cinched you in. It made, you, it made me feel comfortable. I wore it for like a week. Um, they said I could take it off whenever I was comfortable taking it off, so I did that. I did wash it, though, after I got home from the hospital. We, I did wash it. Cause, um, let's see. It took like two weeks for the strip, the surgery strips to fall off. It took like two weeks for those to fall off. Um, a couple of my dissolvable stitches popped out of my scar so actually when I did my follow-up with my primary care she went in and um, snipped those down so that they wouldn't bother me um, I'm all healed I mean there's still some scarring but the scars are teeny tiny little scars and pretty much that's all I, that comes to mind right now I never had problems going to the bathroom number one or number two um, as a matter of fact, that's what motivated me to get out of bed to start walking um, in the hospital was because I really had to use the ladies' room because they pumped me so full of liquids. Um, and oh, so I do, I did get a, this is what prompted me to do a video, is I did get another um, box. And so I thought I'd share it because I did go through it, but I thought, oh, I need to, before I start losing, like taking it out of the box and losing it all, I should go through it with you guys. And I know I haven't been consistent. I'm sorry, but, you know, I was a little busy. So this is the Bariatric Pal Box of the Month for August. Um, I just got it in the mail today. And the first thing I got was these protein donuts. Let's see. There, that's better. This is 160 calories and 14 grams of protein per serving. Looks like there's just one donut in here. Um, the second thing I got was this Macro Snacks, cheddar cheese, it's 140 calories, uh, 16 grams of carbohydrates, one fiber, so that's net grams 15, protein 11 grams, so that's pretty good. I guess the whole bag, these just get the percentages. This is one package, so if you ate the whole package, I don't think I could eat the whole package. Um, Super seeds, pumpkin seeds, love pumpkin seeds, eight grams of protein per ounce, and this is five servings. That's very generous. That's actually that's probably a full-size bag. This looks like it could be a full-size bag, too. Brahmi balsamic herb lupini. I don't know what the heck that is. What is lupini? Oh, it's a bean. Fewer calories than almonds, 50% more protein than chickpeas, 2.6 more minerals than coconut water. Interesting. Uh, three servings per container, 65 calories, um, one, one gram of carbohydrates, and seven grams of protein. Oh, that's interesting. So just to throw it on your salads, it's a, it's a little damp. A little bit of moisture in there. Um, Stevita, Sublime Strawberry, Hard Candies, that's good, that's something I can keep in my car with the extreme heat here, um, let's see, the meal plan that they always put in there, this one I'm in, really interested in breaking into, um, it looks, they're soy wraps, and they're like sandwiches or for you know reps deli meat tuna salad that kind of thing and this is super cute but way 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 too big just, look at my hand there is no way i can eat this much food but it's cute it's melamine you can take it by the pool i guess um yeah so i got a plate looks like a kid's plate 
I might take this, um, keep this in my car just in case I have, oh, maybe I won't keep it in the car, maybe I'll keep it in the house. Anyway, that's, that's the box this month. It's, um, good, really, oh, there's six wraps in here, so that's six sandwiches. I don't know if I can eat the whole wrap. So, um, yeah, I'll talk about the other, like, what I'm eating and stuff. Um, I do a lot of soybeans. That's my favorite thing. I just thaw them. I keep them in the freezer in half cup containers, and then I just pull one, and I just start eating it frozen. Um, usually that's my lunch. It's just a half a cup of soybeans. Already shelled. That way it's all, I portion it out and stuff. Um, let's see, I need a sip of my water. This is um, Crystal Light. I actually got this container. It's an arrow bottle. It's a shaker bottle that doesn't need to, you don't need to put um, a ball in here. It's the way it's shaped, I guess. And so this screws on. It holds 28 ounces of liquid. And look at that. You can't lose the cap because it's it has a hook. So you can hook it into a backpack or something. But this screws on and you can shake it. I just have um, some crushed ice and crystal light. Um, so for 28 ounces, I do one package, I dilute it. And then earlier today, I had my, I do this practically every day. I have all the flavors, but chocolate is my go-to just because I love chocolate. So yeah, that's it. Have a great day. If you have any questions, let me know and I will try to be more consistent with my videos and I hope you guys are all doing great. Bye.